Annette Alferio, and I am the owner and artistic director of the Movement Lab. And I'm also the artistic director for our five dance companies. Uh, we have The Squad, Velocity, Extraordinary, Surge, and Urban Dance Collective. So The Squad, it started off uh, like five, four or five years ago uh, when I first relocated to Santa Rosa. And it started with uh, about five members, teenagers. And um, it has grown over the years. Um, this year we have 16, 17 members. Um, I wanted to create an outlet for teen dancers and sort of a, a community for them to come together and share their passion for primarily hip hop dance um, and urban dance styles. Well, my hope is that. You know, first and foremost, I want to create artists. I want I want each dancer to find their artistry. Um, as a group, I feel like we are have made huge progress the last few years, and um, we're not we go to competitions. We're not a competition based company, um, but I'd like to see them continue to get recognition from the hip hop community in the Bay Area and beyond. The purpose of the company is to bring young people together um, to share their love and passion for hip hop. And I think um, it's a positive outlet. I think it's an artistic outlet. I think it's, it builds confidence, it builds character, it builds integrity. And, uh, you know, I love dance, so I feel like there's nothing better than coming together with other people who share the same passion. Um, the audition process, it, it kind of varies every year. I try to, I'm trying to raise the bar, um, so usually it's, it's one day and um, there's some notice, dancers sign up to audition, and it's about two hours. They warm up, you know, I, I like to have a few other faculty watch them while I'm leading the class. We do a warm up and then usually I'll teach a combination and then there's some kind of freestyle component to kind of allow the dancers to showcase what their strengths are. We went to a dance convention last year called Monsters and I feel like it was the first time all of the dancers kind of really, really deeply fell in love with what they were doing because they were surrounded by hundreds of other people who loved the same thing. Um, they shined in the, within the classroom so they got some love and recognition. Um, and that made me feel good because it tells me that we're on the right track and that everybody's progressing. Um, and it was really fun to see each of them just light up and fall in love with dance, but fall in love with like the hip hop dance community on a different level um, that I don't think they realized existed before they went to that convention.